Today we're going to be exploring chords in OpenRP. We're going to do a deep dive into it. Hi, welcome to the Harvesters Ready. I'm Stephen, and today we're going to be doing a deep dive into using chords in OpenRP. If you haven't checked out my previous previous video that covers the installation of the custom stage views, that the new custom stage views, which include the usage of chords, please check it out. The link is in the description below, and it's probably in a card above so that you can actually click it, click it quickly. So, without further ado, let's get into it. So. With OpenRP, with OpenRP, we have ignore that. OpenRP is running just fine. Okay, so with OpenRP, we've got in the settings and in formatting tags, you would have added these two custom formatting tags: chord line which identifies the verse that contains chords and the actual chords accordingly. Okay, so let's get into it. Now we're going to do the quick and easy way of doing this. So if you've got a song that's already formatted with chords just in the traditional sets with the chords above it, we've got a cool little tool for you. So if we go to the settings and we go to tools and open your data folder, in that custom stage view package under stages, there's a nice little folder called text open LP boards. Okay. So you open this up and you put this in here. So we're going to find a song, which is here, more love, more power. We're going to copy it, copy it as plain text. And we're going to put it in here. So we're going to do Control A and right click paste. Okay. Let's just tidy this up quickly because we don't want some of these things. So you just make sure it's all tidy, that there's no erroneous spaces. Okay. Between the verses. The verses can have a little bit more space, that's fine. So you just remove the spaces and it will put in the formatting tags. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Last little bit here. Let's just put an extra space in here so it doesn't get confused. And remove that space there so we don't have the, the too much there. So now we want to say with chords here and formatting convert. Sorry. Um, okay, here we go. So as you can see here, if you have a good look at this thing, what happens here is each one of these verses. Oh, maybe it's down below. Yes, it is there is. Okay, each one of these verses you see begins with a CL and a close CL. Okay? Right? Got that? So that's what you put at the beginning and the end of the verse. Each chord is encapsulated with a chord tag, which is this one here, and closes with this one here. Okay? And in brackets, square brackets, you put the key. So you can type this manually, but as you can see, this is so much simpler if you do it this way. So here we go, okay? So we've got that. So all we have to do is do Control A and copy that. Go back to OpenRP, create a new song, type in the title. and then edit all and paste in that whole thing okay here we go save oh we need an author let's just add the un author save here we go we drag it over yep. okay 
Right, so there we go. So we go to the stage view. Let's reload that. You can see now. Here we are, see? You can change the capo. Changes the key. So there we have it. It's not too difficult. Using that OpenLP generator, you can easily convert your existing songs that are already formatted with the chords above the lyrics into OpenRP. You just have to make sure you've got it lined up correctly in the converter and then you just select with chords and formatting and click convert and it will do it all for you automatically. You copy and paste that into OpenRP and you're as good as done. You can also do it manually but it takes a lot more time. So yes this little converting tool is very very useful. So if you like this video please like comment and subscribe and Check us out on my Facebook page and see what we're doing there. And till next time, God bless.